Hello and welcome once again to Brick Fury for Suppressing Fire. I'm Brad Hummer Barnes. Joining me here is Joe Crouch Hello. and Ian Hummer. Hello. And we're joined by a very special guest this time, Rob Wade from Emotionally 14. Hello. 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 And hello to you. Hello. Well. Yes. Seems fair. Physically, yeah. you're older than 14, though, right? Physically, yes. Because I will be using coarse language. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Emotionally 14, but corporeally 31. <laughs> <laughs> Good. We can work with this. Yeah. 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 But it's a lot harder to get the domain name. For yeah. Me. Physically in my 30s.com. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it's just. <laughs> Please have a side blog corporeally 31. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why I need more projects, good. <laughs> okay, so we're here to do an unboxing for the Superman Wonder Woman series Indeed. for DC. Uh, Joe, yeah. any thoughts or excitement about this particular series? Well, I'm hoping to get a cat. That was last time. I didn't move on. Okay, so I'm hoping to get a cat. <laughs> the desires are still strong. There's a dog in this one, though. I, I think it'll be quite a special dog, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. <laughs> Not just a, an ordinary dog. <laughs> One of your bog standard Hero yeah. Clicks dogs. I'm getting ordinary dog everywhere. Okay, can we check the conveyor belt on? Get the hoop clicks yeah. up here. Conveyor belt on the conveyor belt. Cuddly <laughs> toy. The jerky conveyor belt. <laughs> you got jerky on it as well. So, yeah. we, Rob. Yes. How long have you been playing Hero Clicks for? Uh, just over a year. Okay. And in that time, I've accumulated all the Hero Clicks. <laughs> In the world. How many do you have? Over 500. Okay. Um, yeah, I've been very lucky. Don't, don't think of it in points, guys. <laughs> no. Um, in, <laughs> terms of, oh, in terms of points, uh, it's somewhere in the region of 15,000, 16,000 worth Brilliant. of potential. Um, I've been very lucky on eBay and very unlucky in boosters, which is why I keep buying the bloody things. <laughs> uh, and I do quite like the collecting element of it. So this is kind of mm -hmm. quite exciting. Is there a particular type you go after? So Joe goes after like the cosmic Marvel stuff. Ian goes after his team Raven off stuff. Is there a particular theme that you go for, or just whatever you fancy? I seem to have accumulated a lot of Batman, so I'm going to go with okay. that as my Batman theme. Batman's, Batman. um, lots of Batman's family. Um, okay. And a few, I've got quite a few Marvel ones of various different types, but um, there's no real theme except Constantine, um, mm -hmm. which is still, still going on. Yeah. <laughs> still eluding you. Yeah, look forward to that. I do. Because you actually you have two Hero Clicks shows, don't you? You have Man Baby Power Hour. Yes. And um, so there's, yeah, there's Man Baby Power Hour, which usually is just me opening things with a particular, looking for a particular figure or figures. And then we have Blind Bad Battle, which is more of a Top Trumpsy style game. And that's just playing around with the values on the dials and just using it for a bit of fun, make a traditional unboxing. Mm -hmm. uh, especially of Gravity. Yeah, it's, it's like hard. It's, it's, a great, it's a great series. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I like it. Yeah. More, you, more um, people should watch, you watch it. Yeah, you know. we'll, we'll stick with it. So you, you, know, you don't battle with bags over your heads? No, we tried it, the pilot was like that, and then we found that we were unconscious. <laughs> so for the second episode, we decided to go with yeah. the, mm. the, the way that kept us awake. Because one, for no, if nothing else, by the time we got to the second episode, the battery on the phone had run out. Are you a Batman comics fan in particular, or we just uh, kind of gone that way with the Heroclix? Uh, I quite like the Batman comics um i tend to skew slightly more dc than marvel although i'm mm -hmm. not there's no real clear kind of favorite to me sure. um i tend to skew more towards dc because they've got some of the characters i like like constantine um i've been reading a few like random green lantern issues mm -hmm. which i quite enjoyed green lantern's cool yeah he's cool. i quite like it to be honest yeah. um and i watched read a really good trade the other day called world war three which is just black adam fucking shit up there <laughs> the center. i do um, um yeah green lantern I, he sticks in my mind because there's there's a lot of Marvel characters are quite like DC characters, and this guy's quite mm. a lot like Marvel characters. And Green Lantern's never really been copied or emulated. Mm. No, I suppose not. I don't know. I'd, I'd say Nova is the closest to Green Lantern. Right, but he yeah. doesn't have that, like, the force generating. He doesn't, yeah, powers wise, not so much. Mm -hmm. But, like, oh, the we know the core of Green Lantern. Yeah, they can't see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Powers wise, yeah. yeah, he's not really been. Joe, so you're shopping for a cat? Even though there may not be one it in probably the small list. But one can hope. <laughs> oh my god. Ian, what are you shopping for this time around? Really? Well, I've been using a lot of force power and hoping to get Hades. Be Hades, 14 star, Raven right? Loft. Yes, <laughs> that'll be the star. And I'm really intrigued about the Colossal in yes. here. Yes, normally the, or the standard packaging is that there are 10 standard retail boxes in one of these. And we've actually got eight, and there's then one big one here which is the Colossal Super Booster. So it's a randomly packaged Colossal figure. It can't be a downside. 
there's no doubt. No. So it retails approximately, is it fifteen pounds? It retails for. Um, yeah. I've seen it for fifteen pounds. So we've seen it about yeah. fifteen pounds. That's not that's not bad. Not bad. For a though. parcel. No, no. Pretty good. It's it's, yeah, just enough that they'll make their money from it, and just low enough that I'd be encouraged to. You gamble. Yeah, gamble. to get some more. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. That's actually sure about having bought. I don't know about recommended retail price, but most online retailers you can pick up a standard booster for about twelve pounds. Yeah, for an extra three quid to get a colossal. Yeah, I think the, re yeah, I think the recommended retail on the boosters in stores is about ten ninety nine. Okay. Like that. Um, so the colossal boosters I've seen similar size things. So they do the Trinity War, Rock of Eternity, and Pandora's Box resource, mm -hmm. which is I think you get it for buying two booster bricks. So you have to spend a fair whack to get it, but I think they sell it separately for about fifteen quid. So mm -hmm. it's kind of similarly priced. Yeah. Um, yeah, because if you were going in and buying a standard one, you'd be tempted to chuck an extra couple of quid in and try for a colossal. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Is there a particular figure you're looking for in this set? Um, the one I'd actually like to see is the uh, Wonder Woman that's in this set, which mm -hmm. I think is number 33. Um, okay. Mainly for two reasons. It's a really good piece for the points. And also it was uh, on HC Realms, which is a sort of hero clicks forum. Mm -hmm. I saw it the other day voted as the best carded Wonder Woman of the modern age. So oh, wow. it actually yeah. beats the Justice League Trinity War one that I've got. So is I'm it kind the of... New 52 variant one? Um, I think so. Okay. I'm not 100% sure, to be honest. Mm -hmm. uh, but but yeah, that's the one that I'd like to see. Uh, there's also quite a good Green Lantern in here. Uh, mm -hmm. And a character called Lord Satanus or Satanus, yes. depending yes. on how you pronounce it. Yeah, really good. He's yeah. just yeah. a team right now. No, no, he does really well. If he, um, I think getting the dog as well to go with the cat would be brilliant as well. That'd be good. Yeah. Get a whole dog kind of cat fight. rude dog and the dweebs thing going. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you just wait for the animals of Farvey Wood here at Click Series? Oh, man. They'd just be but, KO'd or yeah. click one. <laughs> those, those would be horror clicks, if anything. Yeah, they will. <laughs> I don't know. Emotional you, horror clicks. You've seen that cat play last uh, game we had? It did not go It didn't go down, did it? No, no. Very good. No, really to be fair, the last battle report we did, the cat survived and Brainiac did not. This says a lot. It does. I can, I can believe it. The cat yeah. was really good. Yeah. And I've been bashing it all before that, didn't I? So. Did that help you concentrate? <laughs> 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 okay. So we're all excited. We are. I suppose the only question we're to right. ask is Superman or Wonder Woman? Cats. Superman or Wonder Woman? Wonder Woman. I think Superman. I think I'll be Superman as well. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. we're filming some International Women's Day. So. Superman, <laughs> Superman to me is like Captain Scarlet in that he is so powerful as a general rule that mm. I find it hard to get invested. He needs a very good writer to do yes. it. You, I mean, it can be done, but it takes yeah. a good I mean, one of the things that's in here is the Red Sun. And that's that a really clever take on the Superman mm. in the comics, certainly. Yes, absolutely. Uh, and just anything where he's in any kind of danger because. The majority of the time, I just think, well, he's going to be fine, isn't he? Superman. Yeah. It's not likely he's going to be in any kind of anything that's going to. The worst case scenario is a bad guy has a radioactive rock, which will kill them as well. Well, quite. Yeah. yeah. And you know, I also find the concept of being allergic to a rock on your home planet a bit weird. Anyway, it's like me being allergic to granite. <laughs> it's like me being allergic to peanuts, which occur naturally. Well, should, have, should have been fed more as a ch fed more peanuts as a child. Yeah. I was about to say you should have been fed more as a child, but I can't presume that you weren't. No, <laughs> yeah. I was chunky. Yeah, fair enough. All right, maybe you should have been fed as you were. We'll insert a before folks out of it. Side by sides are quite easy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah right. There's also a Lex Luthor in here that's quite good. Oh, cool. About cool. It. Um, and obviously, great, I like great having, bad guy. He is a great bad guy. I like to have Lex Luthor's in my team because you like to punch their heads off. <laughs> Lex Luthor not done. Oh, well is there a story here? Yeah. Is there a story here? Oh yeah, first time I ever played uh, Hero Clicks uh, was with you guys, with my using my own clicks, and I was really happy with them. I've got the, a really cool Batman, I've got a really cool Lex Luthor. And he does look good. He does, does, yeah, yeah, he yeah. looks great. Yeah, yeah. But he didn't look so great, covered in his own blood. Yeah. <laughs> in a ditch somewhere. What, what, did, you, what did you do? It you? wasn't just him, it was also your brother. Ah. Your brother, who should remain nameless, Blake. <laughs> You just remain nameless. Nameless play. He, um, they, because of the way we were playing, they were both either side of me, and they just kind of rounded in really mm -hmm. early on, and just happened to roll really nicely on things like Blaze Claws Fangs, rolled sixes everywhere, oh, and uh, I Blaze Claws Fangs is the deadliest power in the game. I'm I sure can't, I can't dodge them. It, you went to some speed. Speed. Yeah, actually, when you speed, speed is great when you use it. It went down to a thirty-one point werewolf, didn't he? He did, yes. <laughs> uh, because uh, Blaze Claws Fangs rolled a six. Was it one of the ones that I? Was it a male one or a female one? Is this like the time I tried rocket towards Red Hulk? Yes. And there was just a noise like a golf ball. 
Yeah, yeah. that's my first experience of playing because I borrowed clicks to play before, and this yeah. was the first time playing with my own clicks. Got my own team. I've got my own team. Two turns later, I had my own team. And I wouldn't mind, except that became the running gimmick for about nine months, was that I just couldn't get a look in for second to last place. <laughs> You've picked up a lot of clicks in games, though. That's I did, yes. Yeah. And let's not talk about any more of that. <laughs> <laughs> right, time to crack this open, I think. Yes. Let's do this thing. All right. Drum roll. This is the exciting moment for the first box. Well, that was interesting looking sculpts already. I'll tell you what, I'm going to go for another one first of all. Yeah, definitely not Cersei. Who's a cool looking character? Cersei. Cersei, okay. That's what it looks like to me. Mystical ruler. Uh, mystical, yeah. An animal themed team may include Cersei and it's still a themed team. Ah. 115 points. Looks Mind pretty hats. cool, actually. Can use mind control. When she does, she isn't dealt, or dealt unavoidable damage from using mind control. That's a nice model that's, as well. Looks like it's got like. Um, Power running around her body, yeah. Next one up, it looks like a hat to me. It is hat. Yeah. Special power is magical hat. Yes, he looks like somebody who's passed away. And this that is, it uh, yeah. looks like a brute, this guy. Uh, cold cast. Oh, I'm so excited. What are you excited about? This is a... He's got a Parker well, on. This is, yeah, this is oh, the, the Superman that we were, the we were looking at on the... <laughs> Yeah. Hello, man. That is so well made. I wonder where the he paint is. Job, yeah, yeah, that's so nice. So, so I may actually have to destroy the package and get it. No, I've had these. This is part of the challenge. Ah, uh, capes. We've got a fast forward button. We'll go to the other thing. It's fine. This is nice Dr. Fate. Also known as Captain Fabulous. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously, that's how I'd paint him up. That's a really nice That one. is a serious cape. Serious points cost. So this is. Box number two. All right. Nice. So you're on card oh, duty. Card duty. So let's start off at this end. The Maxima runs at 125 points. So nice. She's a bit heavy hit. She's, she's cool yeah. looking. That's a really nice sculpt actually. I quite like that. We've got Ulysses. 150 points. That is the mullet to destroy all mullets. That is some mullet That's right there. The Let or... me see if I can get that in shot. <laughs> I misread this as Armand, but it's Apollo. Oh. <laughs> I'm Armand. sorry, it's not Armand. <laughs> I do apologize. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Ignores hindering terrain for purposes of line of sight. Don't we all? So this is Menagerie. Oh, brilliant. There you go, animal themes again. Yeah, that's brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. So that's good. She's got, uh, that's quite a nice sculpt, isn't it? Nice wings points. on the back. Nice and then finally, Ooh. Amazon. Mm -hmm. Prime? Give <laughs> me to it. <laughs> Get out. What are we, box three? three. Yes. Box, box three. three. Okay. This has been cut because I've got a track record of being... Because you can't be trusted with sharp things. Can't. I can't be trusted with cardboard as well. There's some cards. I'll look after the cardboard for you. Thank you. We have Investigative Reporter. Oh. Real name, Various. <laughs> and Sid Various. For some reason, Significant appearance, Various. <laughs> he has a mask. Why? That's awesome. The glasses, aren't they? Okay. <laughs> the one thing everyone in the show is wearing. This is Soldier. <laughs> Real name, Various. Significant appearance, Various. The thing is, he's part of the police. We have Not Namor, also known as Ariel. No, it's mermaid. Real so, name various. That, Significant okay, this, various. This is like <laughs> just Christian Anderson. This is just a generic one, but yeah. like the sculpt is amazing. It's really nice, yeah. Sculpt is really, well, really she's nice. She's got swim, that's always handy. Clark Kent. Not a mask. So it's the I'm same. Not sure where they got the mould from. Ooh. Lady Blaze. Right. Okay, so she's mystic. That sounds like a razor. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> 145 you know, points. She's, the, she's the one in that box, isn't she? She's a hit that box. She's cool. Look at her. Oh, God. Yeah, she's... She has so many powers I've had to drop for font size on the card. Brilliant. Okay, so pack number four. We have Investigative Reporter, who we Which had we all in the previous... And now there's two of them. That's really he good. looks a bit yeah. like Johnny Cage. And we have Soldier again. We have... Mermaid, I'm pretty sure this pack is exactly the same as the last one. No, no, no there's a couple more so. different. Oh, okay. One I yes. We have Superboy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, I recognise him. Teenage Angst, Superman. She's Team Titans. 
Yeah, seems fair. Keyword. He's got three keywords, actually. Laurie Lamaris. Yeah, so she's an Atlantis keyword, which is interesting because even as recently as Trinity War, the keyword's been Atlantean. That'd be interesting. Ooh, That's interesting. so she could team up with Namor. Okay, so we are box number oh, five. Five. Oh, 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 I'm excited now. Oh, 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 oh. Another really cool sculpt, as you can see. Yes, it is. You can see that the detail on the on the model. That's a one fifty. Is he? Yeah. Oh, so it's a different. Oh, okay. It is a different one. Yeah. Yeah. Rock and roll. Newsboy Legion. That's handy if you're putting together some Baker Street regulars. I'd buy the shit out of that. Just a little fifteen pointer, but nicely paint. Nice paint job. Mm-hmm. Little bow tie. It's from the past. It's from the past. <laughs> Real name, Various. Significant appearance, 1942. Various is a really popular name. Yeah. 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 In the comic universe, I found this a lot. You know what it's really popular among is parademons. <laughs> okay, we have here... Huntress. Huntress. Oh, very nice. Cool. She is looking cool. A general. General Lane. Yeah, that's definitely Lane. what's got me excited. Give it yeah. a minute. Yeah. This is Lord Satanus. Mm -hmm. And uh, his small scythe that he seems somewhat, to have. Somewhat large size. 55, yeah. So, and we're linked with... Um, Lady Blaze. They're lookers, aren't they? Oh, yeah. them a power couple. Where the bloody hell have you been? <laughs> I've been in another box, love. <laughs> you what? <laughs> All right, box number six. Uh, oh, my. Could do that. Power Girl. Oh, sorry. Lois Lane. Okay, I'm 40, 45 points. She's a unique character as well. She is a unique character. Oh, well. That is Lana oh, Lang. We have both of the love interests. We do. And we've got two Supermans, so there's no need for any hurt feelings. <laughs> it's the first Wonder Woman hey. of the set. Oh, of nice. the Superman Wonder Woman set. Of the Superman Wonder Woman set. Not the specific one I was hoping to see, but nonetheless, 125 points is Not quite bad. good. Yep. And now we have Power Girl. That's a really nice sculpt. Actually. Friendly characters named Huntress could use toughness. Nice. Oh, this is the renowned Power Girl top, isn't it? And we've got the one yes. Mrs. World. <laughs> yes. 140 points. And then another Wonder Woman. Okay. So not, just like buses, aren't they? Yeah. Nothing comes along and then two yeah, at once. They haven't painted their trousers. Once again. So this is a different Wonder Woman. Uh, the same sculpt by the looks, but a different paint job. So mm -hmm. we haven't got the trousers. She's gone with the more classic kind of hot pants style thing. Same pose. Uh, 100 points, this one. Box number seven. Already opened. <sighs> that is cool. That uh, This is Atomic Skull. That nice. is awesome. That's really cool. It looks like something at Hellboy. Like mm -hmm. something that uh, Mignola drew. Yeah. 150 points, yeah? I think this is Banana from... Aldo Montoya? <laughs> no, this is Guardian. Um, okay. I have no idea who that is, really. He's got, he's got the police. He does. Um, yeah, actually looks all right. It looks sorry. pretty cool. We have Sister Superior. Um, kind yeah. of looks like Madam Web. Yeah, but as a yes. nun. As a nun, yeah. She's a robot. She Okay. Maybe, she is. maybe, maybe she's she, a cyborg. She can be one of the metal ladies. First Batman. Yay! Hey. Whatever. Uh, yeah, first Batman ever. He's got he's got red. You got red on you. Yep. Yes, he has, hasn't he? Uh, so he's got the Gotham City and Wonders of the World keywords. Is he? Because there's a different Batman. Is it's not Bruce Wayne? Is is? Uh, so this is Thomas Wayne. This is his oh, dad. Okay. Oh, he appears okay. for the first time in Earth Two Annual Number One, 2013. All right, we got another. Uh, Superman, we, we do love this model. So this is the this is the sculpture this is number one. Seen. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so this is box eight, the final standard box. Yeah. Standard booster. Frame so up. So because you Parademon, Rob, yeah. you're you're shopping for some of these, I, aren't you? I, I, yeah. He why looks, not? Um, he looks meaner than the ones that he you does. Know, yeah, he doesn't have the wings like the ones I've got. I think the ones you've had were like the pawn guys, and he looks a bit tougher. We have accountable. Yes. Uh, so, <laughs> so he's so, uh, 33 points, which is a uh, weird value. One. <sighs> with a recurring three. Whizkids, if you only hear me say one thing, stop doing odd number points. <laughs> Unless you explain the reason. So he's got... Uh, we have Elwood Blues. Paul Stanley. 
Mr. Hat. We have a red tornado. Red <laughs> uh, So this is a robot reporter with Wonders of the World. Supergirl. So she's 160 points. Oh! Okay, just, where are we looking? Uh, the damage just keeps getting higher. So it's and probably... this does need another drum roll, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So this, is, this is the Colossal Booster. Open my, open my Rob. Drum is so exciting. Oh, I think I know what this is. It is oh, the Batman oh, Superman oh, robot. I got it. Nice. Good Lord. He's a looker, I can he's... barely get this in shot. This thing's huge. 700 points, you say? Oh, nice. Good Lord. Uh, well, 700, 450, 300, 150, or 25. 25 so is just... 25. 25 is just... Oh, I forgot to put the battery in, Barry. I think the 25-point thing is um, is a new thing they're trying to do, so like you can have a Colossal on any force. Oh, OK. Um, um, if Batman Superman Robot began the game on the 25-point starting line, it can't attack smaller characters except via Colossal Retaliation. And we're back. In many ways, we never left. <laughs> in the literal sense, for example. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so that was the unboxing for the Superman Wonder Woman DC Comics Hero Click set. Thoughts, Ian? I think we did marvellously as far as... No, um, we, did, we did DC, Lee. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think the, the Colossal is amazing. Um, yeah. Of all the ones that are available, I think it's the ones that I strike. We lucked out. Yeah, 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 absolutely, okay. yeah. Um, and uh, only one Batman. Uh, I believe, and but we've got not even um, real one, and not even real one. This is <laughs> that, yeah. Um, and uh, the the Superman models we got are really, really well made. I think it's been really good and mm -hmm. revealing as well. Yes, and revealing. Okay, Rob. Um, yeah, I think I, I echo some of those sentiments. I think the colossal is awesome. Um, there's some really nice sculpts in here. I'm kind of interested that we didn't really see. I mean, obviously on the box there's like three or four different groups into which mm -hmm. they all fall and I only really saw one or two of them so yeah, okay. that there's not much of a there's not much of a spread in terms of variety but what we've got's really good yeah so it makes me wonder if are the figures in the other in the other half we didn't see just as good if not you know better so it's I, just a I, really good brick I, I felt the individual boosters a few of them didn't feel as well balanced as others because mm. I have noticed when we did the um, the Dick Fury unboxing all of those bricks felt, bricks with boosters felt balanced kind of yeah. across the middle range. There's always something when we did the Batman Superman set, there was a tough guy and then some cannon fodder okay. here as well. This one felt a bit more chaotic than that. There was some really was one box was some was just yeah. a bunch of jobbers. Yes. Yeah. 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 This one, this one kind of feels to me like a. I don't really understand why it's why it's a thing. You know, like okay. this, the you know as the world's finest. I sort of get it because obviously it's tying into the Batman Superman thing. Mm -hmm. well, there'll be a, what I'm guessing is a gravity feed to come with the film itself. But this one just feels kind of, in some ways, kind of shoehorned in alongside World's Finest. When yeah, it feels like the ones up, that didn't fit into World's Finest. Yeah, when they could have a lot of these could have turned up in there. You know, I think really um, maybe not so much the Red Sun stuff and. Which, I mean, we, some we, of the which, which we didn't see, yeah. I mean, some of the Earth, nice idea. some of the Earth Two stuff maybe, yeah, might not fit. But some of the support characters we got turned up. I yeah. really liked. I think mermaids are. At first, I was on a bit on the back foot about those, but as I've looked at them, they seem interesting support pieces. Yes, yes. and then they're not. Some of the journalists didn't like the, uh, the lowest yeah, yeah. investigative reporter characters. They seem to have some really intriguing powers. They do, yeah. I mean, a bit of forward planning, you could seriously scupper an opposing team with those. Yeah, the, the world's finest set didn't have a lot of Wonder Woman in it at all. So, mm. I mean, this, this is primarily sort of, obviously it's in the name, so you've made Wonder Woman, but yeah, so brought that yeah, the, the point of this set, I think, was to have, you know, you've got your Amazonians, mm -hmm. we got one. Um, yeah, that sort of strikes me as odd, because obviously we did the Batman and Superman yeah. last month, and there was a lot of Batman and a lot of Superman in it. Yeah. This one, one we've got two Wonder Women, both in the same pack. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. There's yeah. something, but the distribution of the seeding doesn't seem as good as it's been on previous boxes to me. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty much my feeling on it. Yeah, you know, it, like I say, what you've got's really good, but there's not much of a variety in terms of, you know, the range of that mm -hmm. stuff. You know, there's not. I haven't really seen a huge amount of kind of iconic Superman villains in this box either, yeah. which is also well, that's really true. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is seems to be. I think what we said about the Batman Superman set was. It felt like even if you were, like, oh, we are principally Marvel players, mm. if you wanted a Batman or a Superman, you could go into a shop, pick up a pack of that, and you'd have some DC characters that you recognised. Yeah. Whereas these, this one seems to be very much more a DC players. Yeah, 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 I can, yeah, I'll go with that. Yeah, I think that's probably true. 
There's a few of them. I mean, there's, you know, not everything I recognise. Mm-hmm. As Rob said, that's pro- that might be to do with the forthcoming movie coming out. Maybe they've wanted a more sort of a general release mm-hmm. uh, for, for the last set that we opened. Have you confirmed a movie time in the series? Um, I've said something about Gravity Feed, but I'm pretty sure I read there is a Batman Superman set. Because, uh, yeah, I think there's, the a, there's, there's a, a last one. either not world's finest like oh, Batman okay. versus I think Superman. It's either, either okay. a Fast Forces or a starter set for Batman okay. Superman. Because I've okay. seen HC uh, Realms has got um, a set of about sixteen different figures from okay. a Batman Superman set. So I think it's going to be a gravity feed, but I'm not okay. sure. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, I, I've heard that people have been getting like, like armored uh, Batman and stuff. He's from the, the yeah, he's the yeah. he's the rare one. Yeah, I think the, I that's mean, the one I'm gravity for. Yeah, two right. Yeah. Just tell me your thoughts on Raw. Um, yeah, I, I I'm intrigued by all of the the strange like a lot of the mermaids are pretty odd and there's a few creatures in there which um, which is nice to see. Mm-hmm. Um, Tim Raven off mainly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cersei was I thought was really interesting character yeah, yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah agree. Um, Lord Satanus, Lord Satanus, I think. Lord Satanus. Satanus. If you're a really bad audio book narrator, so that'd be the kind of yeah. way to pronounce it. In an yeah. Alan Partridge voice. It's, I can't quite make out who this is, but from the back it looks like Sean Connery and Zardoz. I'm not sure. No, but I, I think like there's there's definitely interesting pieces, mm-hmm. but there's not a lot. Of what, do, what do we think of a colossal? Uh, the colossal's nice. It's it's really really nice. Yeah. Well, what do we think, scary, what do we think of that idea that you could pay a few extra quid and take a colossal home rather than a standard brick? I would have to see yeah. some of the other colossals, but I think mm-hmm. if it, if they're all to this kind of standard, then yeah. it's really cool. And, yeah, 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 the, yeah, you can feel it's it in any size army, really. Yeah, yeah. Well, absolutely. Yeah, you yeah. can pay twenty five yeah. points to have it. And this one's incredibly yeah. terrible. Yeah. I think yeah. it is a canny move. You could be in a shop, see a pack for twelve quid, and then see that next to it for an extra few quid, and go, yeah, all right. I'll, oh, I'll, I'll, I think yeah. the, the twenty five point thing as well is them addressing the fact that. Uh, when people buy colossals, they rarely get to use them. Yeah, you end up having to use them in special scenarios. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. But yeah this way, right. you can go, oh, I've got this really cool colossal, and I can use it. They're not really the suited to sort of general tournament play. Yeah, obviously, no. people are buying it for that sort now, of thing. They're, now they're kind of like putting it alongside the new ID card stuff. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Where you can call in anyone you want, provided you've got the ID card. Is your ID card a colossal? No, that'd be hard. Well, it's Batman and Superman. I'm going to call him Fin Fang Foom for a turn. <laughs> We'd have to call him just Doctor one Manhattan. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's nice they're, they're making it a little bit more. I don't know. Oh I, yeah, I, I it, more it. more accessible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So that's yeah. that's yeah. kind of nice to streamline. I've, 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 I've noticed over the past couple of years here, it does seem to be streamlining. It mm. does seem to be yeah. getting a lot, a lot of rules from. It seems to be speeding up and getting more arcadey in its feel. Yeah, and I think that's a good thing. I think it's yeah, nice think to have. So. It's certainly nice to have the option. I think it'd be mm-hmm. good to have. People kind of, you know, being able to play like uh, to use a forty k example, they can play the kind of standards. I don't know what five hundred points, mm-hmm. and you can play an apocalypse game. Yeah, ten thousand. Okay. You know, it's it's nice to have a kind of range of different ways to play because mm-hmm. it just gives loads of different players a different way to enjoy mm-hmm. the game. And obviously, you know, the more people who enjoy the game, the more stuff gets made. So we're all for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely right. Joe, favorite sculpt. Hmm. I. Oh. Maybe Atomic Skull, maybe Power Girl. I'm, I'm, not, okay. I'm not too sure. You're a Power Girl fan, aren't you? I am, yeah. yeah. But Atomic Skull does look... Really yes, cool. I agree. It's really it's very good. Something out of yeah. Hellboy, yeah. that is. Yes. Rob, favourite sculpt? I mean, realistically, I should say Lord Satanus, because I was hoping to see him, and that's him there. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, I really like Maxima, the, uh, mm, the yeah, flying yeah. one. I, really, I yeah. just really like that sculpt. I'm not sure what it is about it that, uh, you know, draws Boys me in. Ivy but, the cape. Uh, yeah, kind of. I think for mine, it. I'm going to have to go for Menagerie. The that is, guys that is a nice just one. a nice, yeah. idea, nice yeah. pose, nice idea, and done very well. Yeah. Well, yes. Yeah. Uh, well, the, the Superman, I thought I wanted to see it, and it is nicely detailed. But then, I do actually quite like this one. I think the idea of this sort of power running around the body yeah. was really yeah. nice. Yeah, that's yeah. awesome. That's, that's 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 There's another one here. This Sister Superior. I didn't really yeah. get a proper look at her when she was unboxed, but she's almost, you know, she's got that kind of kind of cool like she could turn up in a cyberpunk yeah environment. Okay. She's got you know, power she's got that sort of power fist thing and you know you've got the kind mm. of the outfit that suggests she could turn up in a kind of cyberpunky thing so it's kind yeah. of cool from the back she kind of looks like the main character out of uh, an anime called trigon okay i haven't seen, that you haven't seen it um, no. well maybe i'll edit that picture in yeah cool. <laughs> that would help me a lot especially when i watch it back into yeah. their minds yeah oh tri- oh <laughs> <laughs> So ultimately, 
Thumbs up or thumbs down for this set? Uh, yes. Thumbs up for you. Thumbs up, yeah. Well, yeah. kind of thumbs. Kind of I'm with you. In I'm the middle, like, but kind of slightly up. So, yeah, so, yeah, okay. We'll, 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 well, I, I we've gone like, 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 out. I've, I've, I've written it Batista. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know what you mean, because I, I kind of like, I want to be, but at the same time, there's. There's something about the, the randomness of the scene yeah, yeah. is grating. It's almost yeah, like they're kind of. trying some nice things out in here, uh, especially with the colossal stuff. Yes. Um, I think he's tips the balance, I think. Okay. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. is why I'm kind yeah, of leaning yeah. towards a, more of a thumbs up than a thumbs I think he's he on his own tips the balance, really. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. That's really cool. Yeah. So, you know what comes next? What test him out? Yes, that's true. All right. Well, yeah, yeah, coming back and taking out a few of these for a test run. True. Cool. Awesome. So, look forward to that. Mm hmm. So what are you going to fight him against? Serpent. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your new toy? No. <laughs> How about Cthulhu? Well, there's always a Brainiac skull ship. I think keeping your DC yeah. isn't a problem. Yeah. 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 Or good. against the... Uh... Or against that. I am Plays not it. short of models. No. 700 points. <laughs> Especially so. DC. <laughs> Well, we'll do a DC battle report soon. Yeah. It, it in, might be good to fight him against Trigon because Trigon's yeah. like 500 in points. In the meantime, keep your eye on suppression fire.com for your picks and other related pulp gaming news. Um, Rob, you have a YouTube channel which also does Man Baby Power Hour. Yes. And what was the other one called? Uh, blind Bag Battle. Blind Bag Battle or Blind Box Battle, depending on mood you're in. <laughs> <laughs> you're breaking the fourth wall. Yeah. <laughs> At least you got your name right. Yeah. So, um, there'll be a link to that in the notes, so it's just, just, just click the show more and we'll, we'll link you across there. Uh, I am at RealBradHB on both Twitter and Instagram. Joe, social media? Um, at Grost. Um, Twitter? Yes, yes, yeah. that's on Twitter. My name on Facebook. Instagram? Yes. Sometimes. You, you're really, really shit at this. <laughs> I don't like promoting myself. Okay. It's uh, at Sourcrouch on Instagram, at Grost on Twitter, and Joe's in every crouch on Facebook. Nice um, no, I, MySpace passed me by. Pixo. Face party? Face smash. <laughs> <laughs> Rob, social media. So I'm at Rob Wade Vision on Twitter, um, and I'm on uh, Instagram at Shade Saber. I very rarely do anything with it, but you're welcome to follow. You know, mm -hmm. I can't really stop you. Okay. You can. There's well, an option. Is there? Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Well, private. And you we'll see. Have... We'll see. And your main homepage is? Yeah, emotion14.com, digits not letters. Uh, that's also where you can find... Uh, on Twitter, emotionally fourteen, YouTube, Facebook, all the all social the media things. Ian, social media. Well, I, I run a life you run through the internet. <laughs> oh, I'm around, around it. Somebody runs yes, a life. Yes, yes. So, so I'm um, not so ethereal. So okay. no, I'm not just so more corporeal. Okay. Watch out, we've got a functional human being over here. <laughs> So you'll be able to catch him on the next Brit Fury, probably. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Cool. I'm amazed. I'm amazed, amazed you brought him in for this. <laughs> <laughs> he was. He was his room. So um, thanks so much for checking us out. Keeping uh, stick with us. Got lots more cool stuff coming on the way. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. Real. See ya.